To the broadcast, our sign language interpreter this evening is Wilson Mushora. Now, Gatundu South MP Moses Kuria has been released from police custody this evening at 6.50 p.m. Well, after his arrest and detention at the Kilimani police station. The Kilimani OCS had earlier said that he could not release him because he had not served, had not been served rather, with a court order. Well, there were protests earlier in the day in Gatundu South demanding the legislator's release released with the legal fraternity slamming the state's disobedience of court orders. Take a look. Thank you very much. Upon his release, the Gatundu South MP posed alongside his supporters and Kiharu member of parliament Ndindi Nyoro holding the book Why Nations Fail. I have been released on another bill of 20,000. So they have not yet obeyed the court orders. I belong to the wing where i'm in alliance with the honorable his excellency william ruto and i'm not ashamed to that for that if that is why you're arresting me take me back now for the second night he would have remained in police custody accused of assaulting a seasoned political commentator <laughs> after his arrest fellow lawmakers leaders and supporters allied to the tanga tanga faction made several attempts to secure his release <laughs> And in the back and forth clashed with police. Friday night, Kandara MP Alice Wahome, Kiharu MP Ndindinyoro and Kikuyu constituency MP Kimani Ishungwa, flanked by Senators Kipchumba Murkomen and Aaron Cheriot, castigated the authorities for being what they termed as oppressive and targeting their members in what they alleged was a concerted effort by state officers to intimidate and silence them. Tutaendelea kusema ni vibaya, ni kuthurumu, Moses, ni kukosea sheria heshima. This is impunity of the highest order. Korea's mm-hmm. lawyers maintained the push for his release Saturday morning. The Kilimani OCS had maintained that he could not release Korea because he had not been served with a court order issued on Friday 10th January by Senior Principal Magistrate Kennedy Cheriot. His release, lawmakers said, was pegged on orders from above. And the court orders were verified by the courts. But they have since refused to accept the court order. So the OCS Kilimani uh, has been waiting for orders from above. He Kenya siku anajua kuna mtu anaitwa above. Kwa sababu wakubwa wote wa hii nchi wanajua kwa majina. But pengine nitasoma sheria vizuri ya Kenya. Kujua huyu mtu anaitwa above anakaaga wapi? Ofisi yake ni gani? The legal fraternity also weighed in on Korea's predict- citing their frustration with the blatant disregard of court orders by the state. Defense is an assault. It's not a, um, a felony. Uh, the magistrate has properly uh, given a bond, a cash bear, and we should obey it. I beseech all advocates everywhere in the Republic of Kenya to don the yellow ribbon on Monday and will continue with the yellow ribbon boycott until such a time as there will be compliance with court orders. Former Chief Justice Dr. Mutunga tweeted in the court and any other victims of the disobedience of the law is the inhuman mischief our constitution to heal and heal. It's an unacceptable repeat of the inhumanity of past and present dictatorships end of quote. In Gatundu South Kiambu, protests were held with demonstrators demanding his release. Viva! 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 Kuria is now expected to appear at the Milimani Law Courts on Monday, 13th January. Dorcas Wangira, Citizen TV, Nairobi.